na Kenya atakubali ya kuvuruga amani kuharibu mali ya watu wengine na kwa sababu wengi ambao ni wanasiasa hapa wamenizoea kwa sababu mimi nimezaliwa hapa na wanaona tu ni yule yule alikuwa tu seneta hapa wa county jirani nataka niseme wale watu wote ambao walifanya ile kisirani yote ambayo ilitendeka hapa tutawachukulia hatua na tutapendelea upande wowote kwa sababu ile taarifa ambayo imenifikia ni kwamba watu wa mrengo wa governor wa Meru County walifanya uchochezi walivuruga amani walitusi watu wengine na vile vile walipiga wana habari wakidhani ya kwamba wanatetea governor wa Meru County lakini vile vile wale ambao walichokozwa pia walifanya vitendo vya kuvunja sheria ya nchi yetu sasa ikifika hapo ndio tuwe na taifa thabiti na taifa lenye adabu na la... mumeona vile nimekuwa mkali na nimekalia ngumu wale wanasiasa walikuwa wanataka kuleta ugaidi wale wa mrengo wa azimio walikuwa wanafanya wanajisingisia wanafanya maandamano wanavunga barabara wanachoma manyumba wanandunga wananchi visu wengine wakavunja maofisi hata ya serikali na hata siku moja kabla hatujakuwa ngumu kidogo wengine wakaenda pale kitengela wakaharibu ofisi kama hii ya DCC imejengwa na pesa ya umma na wakachoma mali ya serikali zikiwemo nembo za kitaifa na bendera ya taifa ya Kenya Atuwezi tukakubali inchi yetu ati mtu ajisingizie ni siasa anafanya kuchochea mtu maskini kwenda kupigana na jirani yake na kuharibu mali na kwa hivyo wanasiasa wote na viongozi ambao walihusika na ghasia ambazo zilifanyika Jumapili tutawachukulia hatua na wote lazima waandikishe taarifa kwa polisi wote wote all of them so that in future nobody tries this nonsense again you must learn to persuade people using policies ideas not through violence and not through provoking people into violence na hii mikutano ambayo inafanywa ya uchochezi na kuvuruga wananchi nimesema hakuna mwanasiasa atakubaliwa kufanya mvukutano wa kuvuruga amani hapa tena Sijui yeah. kama tumesikizana yeah. Ukitaka kufanya mkutano fanya mkutano wa kusema sera yako yeah. Useme ile mama unafanyia wananchi lakini mkutano wa kuchochea watu hiyo tumepiga marufuku haitafanyika Sijui kama mmesikizana Tumesikizana. So this is final. The same way we were very firm with demonstrators and rioters, protesters of Azimio who were breaking property and killing people in the pretext of politics. Even here we are not going to allow it. Na mwenye nafikiri ni mchezo, ajaribu. Nimeona kwa vyombo vya habari kuna watu sijui wamepanga mkutano wengine wa uchochezi tu kama huu mahali pengine kule imenti central huo mkutano hautaendelea okay and please don't try me au wenzangu niliwaambia unajua shida ya shida ya kuzoeana ni nyingine au wenzangu tulisema hii shida tunakuanga naye hapa ya nyumbani ya mipaka mipaka tulisema tumalize 
na nikasema ikishindikana tukiendelea na huyu upuzi mimi ndio nitaongoza ile kikosi itaenda kushika wale wote wanaohusika hapa hata ndugu yangu akiwa hapo atashikwa ataingia ndani so likewise the politics of violence politics of incitement must come to an end period number two, those who caused the mayhem of last sunday we are going to arrest every one last of them including the people who beat up journalists who were performing their duties and broke their cameras and damaged their property so naona makofi imepungua lakini i was ready for that i was ready for that i was ready for that na tukifanya hivyo inchi itakuwa taratibu kwa hivyo that is the position hiyo mambo ingine hapo katikati nani anataka kuwa kiti gani nani anataka hiyo muendelee hiyo ni democracy lakini watu wafanye kwa amani nyinyi mungetaka vita jameni unachukua mawe unaenda kupiga mtu mwingine unaribu magari wengine mpaka wakapiga magari ya polisi na mawe sasa hii polisi ndio unasema kujeni mtulinde alafu mnapiga rao na mawe so which is which so mimi nataka niwashukuru mimi mimi nipatie nafasi kidogo hii wakora ndanyorosha hii wezi wa ngombe ndanyorosha hii ni nyorosha hao ni nyorosha hao wanyoroshwe wakwende <laughs> bas nataka sasa vile vile niseme kuna watoto hapa nilisikia waliimba vizuri